Wake up. Tell me bad jokes. Bore me to death with hockey recaps. Just please do something. Project I've been working on for many years. The details of which would go over your head, but it involves advanced stem cell work. This work was in the form of research. Medical journals, rats, that sort of thing. It started out that way, yes. Never sanctioned by any bureaucracy to be more. <laughs> of course not. That would have added years to its progress. So you're sitting there admitting to illegal medical practices? Yes, I guess I am. Give me one good reason why I shouldn't turn you in right now. Because you owe me, Ryan. Your wife is alive today and walking, all because of Orpheus. And where is she walking right now? But you've had to ha have considered it. Otherwise, why are you getting so worked up? I'm getting worked up because you won't let it go. David had Greenlee when we all thought she was gone. And now Dixie is back, and Mom's convinced that David had something to do with that. I mean, don't you think that's weird at all? Yeah, of course I do, yes. I mean, of course, people rising from the dead, that's weird. Well, if David saved Dixie and Greenlee, I mean, there must be others. What if No, no, them... no. Zach is gone. His plane exploded. It is at the bottom of the ocean, okay? He is gone. I'm sorry. I don't need you to be sorry. I just need you to let it go. Okay. okay. Why Why won't anybody just let it go? I don't understand. Just let it go. Is, uh, is this what got between you and Griff? Uh, it doesn't matter, all right? It would have never worked out with me and Griff anyway. Oh, uh, why not? I thought you guys were really good together. Well, you thought wrong. Everyone did. Including me. I think this is where you're supposed to tell me this is all my imagination. And it's not real, and I'm... I'm dreaming. It's me. It's Dixie. to me scheduled for tomorrow. Mandy. Actually, actually, it's a good thing because they feel they can get the whole, the whole thing in one shot. I'll be cancer free. But no more babies. Oh, honey. Now, you look at me. Uh, uh, look, look at me. I have put you through hell over the years. The things I've done to your father and to you. And yet, you somehow managed to survive all that. I am confident you are going to survive this. Hi. Hi. Are you OK? Yeah, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm fine. You sounded so not you on the phone. Uh, well, things have been pretty crazy. Not going to lie. Uh, OK, uh, Biggs, do you, do you really think that you should tell her? Yeah, I, I, I trust Marissa with anything. And to be totally honest, I really need her right now. Okay, now you got me really freaked out. Okay, um, how about you just sit down? Um, okay, you know, that's like the least calming thing you can say to me, right? Okay, just sit. I'll tell you everything. Okay. Uh, 
You know what? I'm, I'm going to go um, go check on Spike and Ian so you can help yourself to anything in the kitchen. Okay. Okay, tell me what's going on. Oh, you know, um, just people coming back from the dead and stuff like that. What am I thinking? Like I have any clue what's in there. Are those drugs keeping you asleep? Or are they keeping you alive? In Greenlee's case, it was spinal nerve cells. In Angie's, retinal cells. Grown for transplantation. That's right. It's the closest mankind has ever come to having the power of life over death. And what a relief knowing that that power ended up in your hands. <laughs> you got that right. Hey, just in time for the show. Perfect timing. Would you please tell Ryan all about Orpheus? Everything I've been able to accomplish? I'd love to. But apparently I don't know the half of it. What is that supposed to mean? Amanda Dillon's mother was brought into PVH today. Burn wounds. Severe? Forget the injuries, David. She insists she's not only seen Dixie Martin, but spent time with her. Wait. Recently. What? Yeah, up at Oak Haven. Dixie Martin's one of the obituaries we found in your office. Did you save her, David? Stash her away like Greenlee? Thank you, honey. Honey. You know, Erica, she's had more lives than she's had husbands. She's gonna be just fine. Well, then why haven't we heard from her? I've left her a million messages. I mean, she could be lying under some smoldering piece of rubble right now. Talking about the fire at Oak Haven? Yeah, did you hear anything? How's Erica? I, I don't know, but I will tell you this. Uh, everybody made it out just fine. There was no bodies found on the oh, site. Thank you. You see, oh. I told you. So, anyone seen Tad? I don't understand. It's not possible. If I let you go, you're gonna disappear. I know it. I'm here. I'm alive. I mean, this is, uh, this is, this, I, 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 have, I have no idea what the hell this is. I watched you die. I sat by your bed and I watched you take your last breath. I remember what you said just before you did it. Together forever. Together forever. Together forever. <laughs> <laughs>